To maintain the firm stance, he has promised himself on immigration. The new French interior minister, Bruno Retailleau, says he is ready to use all the means at his disposal. His main project? Toughening the application of expulsion orders. According to governmental data, the Paris region, the north and southeast of France, account for more than half of all expulsion orders. To encourage deportations, the ministry wants to increase the number of foreigners placed in administrative detention centers. An additional 1,300 beds are planned, but the unions point to a first problem, staff shortages. Before opening new centres, we need to increase the number of staff in existing administrative detention centres. We currently need several hundred people to keep the existing ones afloat. Another difficulty is the complexity of the deportation procedures. In five years, the number of expulsion orders served has surged, resulting in a 60% increase. Flooded with appeals, the courts take months, even years, to reach a decision. And the final obstacle is diplomatic. For the past several years, France has had to deal with the refusal of certain countries such as Algeria to accept the return of their expelled nationals. The French Minister of the Interior intends to toughen his stance. We could see a change in our relationships. For example, an impact on the amount of aid given by France to Algeria or a visa freeze of Algerian representatives. Algeria would have the means to retaliate, but so would France. The new French interior minister also hopes to bring changes to European immigration legislation. To achieve this, he is counting on the support of several European countries such as Germany, who have recently tightened their migration policies.